Well, here I am. Uh, this is the place, the house, where um, my grandfather, my uh, mother's father, um, Sander Larson, grew up with his eight brothers. And uh, this is, you can see how uh, the house was built without any mortar. Okay, and this, this house uh, is from the 1800, early 1800s. And uh, I just love the door. It has, still has the key in it. Okay, so I'm gonna go around here so I can get a better look. the windows up there and this is a very primitive looking house uh, because it is and there's the the original key in the door uh, as you can see and here we have uh, grass covered rocks which is so typical of Orest, and how the land uh, is, is very hilly in certain spots and flat in others. And just check out these stones. Okay, it's an old foundation. And here is the barn uh, where the cows were. And then there are still some chickens here. Oh, quite a few chickens actually. Uh-huh. Okay, and we see this barn, and this is the barn that my grandfather probably romped around in, and certainly brought the cows in. And every good farm has lots of wood, and hello! Hi! Hey! How are you? This is the woman who owns the house. She's not a relative, but uh, anyway, this is the house. And it is it really that I go in so you can film it then. In hos oss. Hey, 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 ja, ja, visst. Hey! Hello. Huset ser så fantastiskt ut! <laughs> ja, ja, ja. Hej! Hej! Hey. Hey. Det var väl konstigt. Uh, is, uh, name is Ab Abrahamsson. Yeah. First name är... Uh, Hans. Vad är det? Hans Abrahamsson. Hans. Hans. Hans, ja. Oh, Hans! Ja. Hans, oh, Hans, okej. Okay. Och din fru heter... Ann-Marie. Ann-Marie. Hans and Ann-Marie ja. Abrahamsson. Oh, yeah. And check out those uh, rocks right next to this house. So this is a new house that was built in the 1930s and and they have just restored it. <laughs> Looks fabulous from the t last time I was here four years ago. And here again we have, you look closely, you can see uh, the rocks and some of the uh, grass that's grown over it and so forth. So here, here is this huge rock and uh, and today is very, very uh, windy, so that rock probably... The old house is my father. Is, uh, oh, yes, they can hear that. Yeah, no, but the best thing we put in English can be this will be on TV. And here is... Okay, this is... Anne-Marie, and this is my cousin, Cheris Den, right here. And she's the neighbor. She was in Lower Huga, and we are now in Upper Huga, where my grandfather grew up. Yes? Yeah. This is the old house, so this is my father's house. Oh, uh, 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 your father was born in this house? Uh, yes. Oh, what was his name? Yalma. Uh, Yalma. Okay, but he wasn't he wasn't related to my grandfather, was he? Uh, my. Uh, 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 me, min, min, um, min father, father. Yeah, his grandfather. Uh, Hette Niklasson Abraham Niklasson. 
Oh, he, he, his name was Abraham Nicholson. Yes. Oh. So Abraham son då efter Abraham så fick yes. Abrahamsson så right. det är jävlar yeah. Abrahamsson min, min ok men så so du var en Niklasson ja my, min uh, farfar your farfar yes ok oh. well my great grandmother was Niklas dotter uh, uh, are we no, related no 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 uh, it's, it's, uh, uh, en syskon Anna hon, hon heter också Abrahamsson ok no. Nej, men jag har min mor. Ja, det jag mor, säger mor, min mor, mor, mor. Nej, nej, min morfars mor ja. heter Johanna Maria Åkerström Niklas dotter. Ja, jaha, okay. So I just ja. said that um, my grandfather's mother was Johanna Maria ja. Åkerström uh, Niklas dotter because he said that his ja. uh, grandfather's name was uh, Nicholson. Ja. And so Nicholas' son and Nicholas' daughter, maybe they were brothers and si brother and sister. Uh, okay, well that's that's we'll find out if we are related. But um, it it may seem so if his father grew up in this house, uh, and my grandfather grew up in this house. Somehow there's got to be a family connection. Okay, so we're going to go inside and check out this old old house. Okay. okay, here I'm going up the steps, and Hans Abrahamson is uh, opening up the old, old house, which is now used as storage. So, I want to show you the, the old, look at that old uh, key, still in the door. Okay. Right, this is the, uh, the kitchen. Yeah. And you, uh, there's a lot of storage in here, but here is the oven. And uh, what I found interesting is, is there a light? Uh, use? No. No. Uh, no. no. Okay. What I found interesting is that this is the um, the, the, the the ovens the doors, oh. you know, and and it says 1855, either on that or down below here. Um, 1855, and that would be just about uh, the time that uh, Sander, he was born, and my grandfather born in 1865, but he had an older brother who was born in 1853. So, 1855 stove would make perfect sense. And this room was? Yes. It's a uh, six-person pe Uh, Sängrum? Ja, fyra farfar och farmor och så fyra barn. Okej, okay, så so he's saying that mm. uh, his grandfather was born here, oh, grew up here with a wife and four kids, four children. Now, take a good close look at the construction. If you can see these beams uh, and nothing is really standard at all. It's just uh, rough hewn from the forest. And over here you look closely, there's some paper uh, over old wood. And these are very wide timbers. And over here, you can see this a little bit better and see how uh, old and wide these are. This house had to be built around 1850, I would assume. Okay, and as we look out, uh, we can see part of the farm. Okay. Uh, jag ska göra, försöka rösta det här huset, renovera det. Yeah. Uh, uh, okay, now, och now göra, göra det ganska fint igen. Ja, yeah. oh, uh. du ska du ska du det. Ja. Oh, wow, wonderful. Uh, yeah. Okay, ska, he's going to make it really yeah, nice jag, again. You can see yes. from 1850. Om uh, två, två år kanske. In about two years or so. Okay. I, I, I hope uh, to, uh, Okay, I'll be back in two years. Yes. <laughs> so I will see it, and he's going to restore this old yeah. house. Yeah. Uh, and, and take a look at how low the ceiling is. Now, uh, he, I would say he's about six feet, and, and, and his, uh, his, there's another, uh, another foot maybe to, up to the ceiling. So it's kind of low, and you have to sort of duck. You see, I'm ducking, and I'm really short. And you go through here. So all the, everybody slept in the one room.
Här uppe hade de en uh, våning upp. Där hade man uh, säden yeah. och allt sånt här. Okej, okay, så so här är en dörr. Ja, S. That goes upstairs, and he said there's a, there was more uh, sleeping quarters upstairs, and he's going to open the door, so we can check it out. But take a look at these old old beams. So and here we can see how dramatic this is. And, and here is some material, some insulation that they put in. It's really just uh, cloth that was put in between the timbers to insulate. We kind of went to go up okay, there. Right okay. Now, uh, oh, there's the door. The door isn't up. Okay, there's the door, uh -oh. and, the, and the staircase goes uh -oh. upstairs. Yes. Okay. Thank you very much, Hans <laughs> Abrahamson. <laughs> so here's the house. You can see there are two floors. There's an upstairs bedroom window, and so forth. So it's a small place, but my great. Uh, was actually very wealthy. He lived from 1805 to 1884, and he was he owned a lot of land and a lot of cows and horses and so forth, and, and this very large uh, farm. And as we go out here, you can see uh, the farmlands. And in the distance, perhaps you can see a car. There's a big highway out there, but way in the distance, and what do we have here? Well, of course, we have cows, and we see cows all over this island. Uh, so here we have, here we have cows, more cows, and these are cows that are being grown for meat. Okay, okay. So you see these huge fields, and this is how everything is laid out. You have fields and you have highways, but the houses are very often not located near the, the major highways or even the, the, uh, the two-lane uh, roads, but rather set way, way back. So the fields are in front and the houses are in the back. Uh, makes perfect sense. Now this house, so here's, um, if we're turning around, here's the house small house, but he was a wealthy man in 1850s, uh, and he was also very smart, and he was a judge in the local district court, uh, and so he was a very prominent citizen. And uh, my grandmother and he had eight, uh, eight boys and one daughter, the daughter died when she was just an infant, and um, the uh, uh, most of those children went to the states, and uh, two of them, two of the boys, came back. Uh, Abraham, my grandfather, Sander, and um, uh, uh, stayed in the United States. Another brother, Olaf Alban, his daughter Esther and son Oscar, came to the states and stayed and married and had family. So. Hans is waiting for me, and uh, I just love what they've done to this house. It was really in disrepair. They had, last time I was here four years ago, they had just bought the house, and he has restored it beautifully. Uh, and he said he's going to do that to uh, my grandfather's house. All right, now we're going to find out if we really are related. Okay. Hi, it's Priscilla Almquist Olsen, reporting from my ancestral home of my grandfather, my mother's father, uh, here on the island of Oris. You've seen the pictures uh, outside and inside, uh, and now we're in the um, uh, house of Hans and Henri um, Abrahamson. And his father was uh, Abraham uh, Nicholson. And so I immediately said, how did my grandmother, she was a Nicholas doctor, so there's got to be a connection there because she moved from here when her husband died in 1884. And he said that his father was born here and lived in that house before this house was built in 1910. Uh, so 
the numbers are correct, uh, it, it may very well be that Hans and I are related and that I have found another relative in Sweden. So we are going, we're hot on the trail, we're trying to find out what the connection might be, because in those days um, you, you sold your farm to family, not to strangers. So a very good possibility that his grandfather, who purchased this uh, house that my grandfather grew up in uh, and, um, and took over the farm here, was indeed a relative. So we will find out. Interesting. Very interesting. Thank you for joining me today. And this is another snippet from Sweden. <laughs> hey, dog.